let's chat real quick. This one's from my servers out there, or people that used to serve. So, you know, you go to work, you're a server, you got your section, they're going to give you, uh, you know, most people tip, like most most people do. Most most people do. They get good service, you tip. Some people tip 10%, 15, 20, 25. Some people tip 30%. Some, some people tip 50%. Like, you know. But when you're a server, you don't get to decide what tables you take. You have a section, you have four tables, you have seven tables, ten tables. Manager decides your section, you take those tables. Anybody, the host seats your section, you take the table. Maybe on occasion you talk to another server, hey, can you take that table for me? I'm busy. That happens. But most of the time, if somebody sits down at your tables, you got to take them. You give them good service, no tip. That happens, you get frustrated. You're in the back of the kitchen at the expo line crying about it. It sucks. I've been there. Or maybe the kitchen messed up the food. Or there was a long wait. Which, as a server, it's not your fault, right? They don't tip you or they're mad. Or they eat everything. Everything's great. And then at the end, they complain. They want something free. We all know those customers, right? There's not a lot of them, but those are the ones that stick out. With this, I get to decide what customers I serve. I get to decide who I take care of. I could decline now all day long if I want, right? There's power in that. Having having to freely make your own decisions and choices. While I sit here and listen to music or listen to a podcast or learn a new language, all in the comforts of my automobile, right? So that's something as a side note to people that used to serve and we get frustrated by not getting tips, I always get tipped because I don't take anything less than that. 